Hey gamers, do you play when you're supposed to be working in class? Did you know that there's to po actually supposed to play games? You're okay. Let's learn more about the Gaming Foundation's gaming, game design and game programming. We first off start off learning about some, um, just some basics about game design. And then we start playing around with animations and coding and making simple games or emulating games. And then moving on as the courses get higher to building our own more complex games. Perhaps the best part about these gaming classes is that there are three of them. Those who, be, who complete the course progression will have a chance to become game developing experts. Right now we don't have very many people in the upper tier class. We have a lot in game foundations and design and so we're just kind of moving up. But um, everybody seems to have a lot, of, a lot of fun. We have a lot of autonomy, a lot of freedom to be able to kind of spend your time making your game the way you want it to be. Those who are unable to get into one of these classes, there are still a chance to get involved after school. Uh, and we also have the um, gaming club, which is recreational gaming right now, and we'll ho hopefully be adding uh, esports and Rocket League soon, and maybe some others eventually. If you're new to the gaming classes, then be sure to start with Gaming Foundations on your course request form. Reporting for Morning News, I'm Mikhail Benson.